Hi, I'm Jason Lund, Product Specialist for 3M Safety Products. While disposable respirators are primarily used for airborne particles, reusable respirators are more versatile. With the right cartridges or filters, reusable respirators can help filter out particles, gases, vapors, or any combination of these airborne hazards. In this training, you'll learn how reusable respirators work, how to use them most effectively, and how to avoid some common mistakes. Let's start with the components of reusable respirators. Reusable respirators consist of a face piece, adjustable head harness, neck strap, and a filter or cartridge. When fit tested and worn properly, the face piece forms a tight seal to the face, helping prevent contaminated air from leaking in around the face seal. Inhaled air is drawn in through the cartridges or filters where the contaminants are filtered, helping provide cleaner air to the wearer. Exhaled air is then released through a one-way valve called an exhalation valve. Face pieces come in multiple sizes and are available in a half face piece or a full face piece. Full face pieces include a face shield for additional eye protection. Next, let's discuss cartridges and filters. What cartridge or filter you attach to the face piece will depend on the airborne hazard you are exposed to. If it's some kind of chemical, you'll need a chemical cartridge specifically designed to help filter out those airborne hazards. If it's airborne dust and particles, you'll need the proper filter based on the type of particle or particles in the air. In some instances, it may be both particles and chemicals, which means you need both a cartridge and a filter. Some cartridges have the ability to attach a filter to the face of the cartridge, while other combination cartridges have the filter already attached for you. It's essentially a two-part system. The filter on top of the cartridge helps filter out the particles in the air, while the cartridge helps filter out certain chemicals in the air. However, even if you have the proper cartridges or filters attached to a face piece, there are some common mistakes that you can avoid. Mistake number one, not obtaining a proper fit. By not achieving a proper seal around the face, contaminated air could leak in around the edges, reducing the respirator's effectiveness. Make sure that the respirator face piece fits you correctly and seals properly by doing the following. Read the user instructions for fitting and adjustments. Maintain a clean shaven face where it touches the respirator. Make sure nothing comes between the respirator and face such as a painter's head sock. Perform a fit test at least annually. And conduct a user seal check every time you use the respirator. Mistake number two not making sure that the cartridge or filter is seated securely and properly oriented on the face piece. Any of our 3M cartridges or filters that feature the bayonet style connection point can attach to any of our half or full face pieces that have a compatible bayonet connection. All it takes is a quick quarter turn to attach it to the face piece. Although 3M's bayonet connection system makes it easy to attach the cartridge or filter, mistakes do happen. You may not turn it fully to seat it or may not have the cartridges sitting in the correct position. Always read the user instructions to ensure proper assembly. Mistake number three, not replacing the cartridge or filter when needed. To maintain respirator effectiveness, cartridges and filters must be replaced by the end of their service life. Mistake number four, not using a pre-filter when needed or assuming the cartridge alone will filter particles. Cartridges are designed to adsorb chemicals in the air. However, they are not made with filtering media to help filter all particulates. You need a particulate pre-filter specifically designed to help filter all particles or aerosolized mists in the air. Remember, if you are using a 5P71 pre-filter and a 501 retainer, make sure to use just one pre-filter at a time for each cartridge. To assemble the pre-filters, Place the 3M filter into the 3M filter retainer so the printed side of the filter will face the cartridge. Then make sure the retainer is securely snapped in place. Mistake number five. The final mistake to avoid, not maintaining good hygiene of the product. Regularly cleaning and disinfecting the respirator face piece and its plastic components as described in the user instructions is essential, especially if used frequently. Now that you understand how reusable respirators work and some common mistakes to avoid, I hope you feel empowered to use them effectively. Remember, it's important to follow the user instructions and conduct a user seal check every time you wear a respirator. Thank you.